Hello, good friends. Happy Monday. Today, I have from the big old Wally World a bunch of blister packs. I'm going to call this Blister Blitz Monday. This is not going to be a weekly thing. I just thought it would be cool. I got a um, Phantom Forces one pack. Repack, uh, Ancient Origins one pack repack. Got two of the Giratina Galaxy Foil Giratina blisters. Have a triple pack of Rebel Clash with the Rayquaza promo. Hang on a second. Thought I saw a foil bleed on that, but I'm pretty sure I was wrong. And I got the Tapu Pin blister, which yeah, it comes with uh, Crimson Invasion and Evolutions. I'm going to start off strong with some Phantom Forces. So, let's get into this blister pack. See what our five bonus cards are. Got some Unbroken Bonds cards. We got a Gligar, Skipping a Ghastly, Tyrogue, Rhydon, and Piloswine, or Piloswine, Piloswine from Breakthrough. And then we got our Booster. Notice how I now have a Mewtwo pop figure in the background instead of a box of team up that was full of, that was opened and full of bulk. Alrighty. So let's see what we got. Got a Spiro, Krabby, ooh, Dino. Robo Sub, that's a decent card. VS Seeker is really good. Boldor. Full Art AZ! I guess this would be a good time to grab my box of Zashian sleeves that is in this Rebel Clash uh, pre release box. And also a good time to bring up that I did open a blister pack off camera and I got a Full Art Cinderace V. So I'll put these in front of Mewtwo. And, um, let's do Ancient Origins. Oh no, we got a Basic Energy as one of our bonus cards. We got a Mawile from Crimson Invasion, Fletchling from Guardians Rising, Geodude Alolan Form from Guardians Rising, and a Sui Illustrated Oak from Guardians Rising. But that was a great first pack. Let's see if we can match it up with Ancient Origins. Maybe get a Giratina or a Lugia. This was back when code cards didn't matter. They didn't matter until Breakpoint. Let's see, starting off with an Eevee. Do me for Mikey. You can also give the Eevee to Mikey. Spinarak. We got the We Acquired the Sire. Matang, Sceptile, Spirit Link, Rotom, Rotom, and Volcarona, the Ancient Power trait half full art, three three quarters art card. Alright, what do I want to do next? I think I'll do the Tapu Pin Blisters with Coco notably left out. Let's see if we can get anything good, like a get like a full art Sylv Ally or a hyper rare Nialigo. It's a name I have not said in a long time, Nialigo, despite that being one of my favorite of the Ultra Beasts. Put the packs in the back, and then take a look at these pins. I dropped the Finny, and where did I... There it is! <sighs> My favorite of the Guardians. Then we have Tapu Bulu. I have a buddy that loves Tapu Bulu. And then my best buddy loves Tapu Lele. I'll probably give the, those the Lele and Bulu pins to my buddies who love Lele and Bulu. Start off with Crimson Invasion because Crimson Invasion doesn't really have any of my favorite of all times. Oof. Oh well. Let's see what we have anyway. There's Altarias in this set. And that's my sixth favorite Pokemon. So we got another Dino, another Alolan Geodude, Aeron, Golden Graveler, Laron, Emolga, Gorgeist, that's a rare foil, and a Gorgeist! Another rare foil. 
well, non-foil version of said rare foil. Evolutions. Oh no, I took the pack off screen. That means I definitely put a full art in here. Got the polywag. Charmander. Zapidos! We got a Zapidos and a Dugong. Zapidos is worth going in the background. Because I like the legendary birds. What should we do next? I think we should sandwich the Rebel Clash in between the Giratina blisters. So these blisters come with the Giratina from Lost Thunder as a promo. Come with that pack, which was an Ultra Prism. And that pack, which is a Unified Minds, comes with a Duskmane and Dawnwings binder, mini binder, a code card, which I will be keeping for myself because I collect Giratinas online as well, and then we have the Deadly Four Pins to get out, and yeah, there's the code card, the Giratina. Let's check the condition. I want to grade one of these. This one looks pretty good. Oh wait, is that damage I see at the bottom? Can't quite tell, but... In a Zashin sleeve it goes. Because it is Giratina, and I love Giratina. That is my favorite Pokemon. I can tell you, this, this setup is a lot better than the one I had on the washer. Start out with Unified Mind, see if we can get a, another Giratina. Oh. Got a white code card. We can get a Giratina, a Mewtwo, or an Espeon. An Onyx. Dragonair. Oh! Okay! I felt the smoothness, but I did not feel the texture. This is a special full art of Slowpoke and Psyduck GX. Zashin sleeve time. Zashin sleeve time. That was not to cover up Cinderace too much. Even though Slowpoke is on or Psyduck, I should say, is almost completely covered up by King DDD's hammer. Now for the Ultra Prism. See if we can get a Giratina Prism Star. I'd love to get me another Giratina Prism Star, as I do absolutely love Giratina. Cannot stress that enough. Got a Roilu, Water Energy, Pokemon Fan Club, no Giratina, unfortunately. Next up, the Rebel Clash Triple Pack. With the Rayquaza promo. Oh See if we can get like a Toxicity, a Dragapult, or an Intelligent. Get the promo out without damaging it, because I'd like to get one. Uh, excuse me, one of these Rayquaza promos graded. Let's see. Looks pretty good. I will sleep it up in a Zash and sleep for now, and then I will, if I decide to grade this one, I will penny sleeve it and put it in the card saver. Alright, start off with, we got two Rillabooms and a Toxtricity. Maybe that's a sign we're going to get a Rillaboom or a Toxtricity. Because I actually got the Cinderace V out of a Cinderace pack. I just saw that was a green code. Oh well, let's just go, go into it. Got a Kerp. Milkery. Reverse Foil Milkery. And a Probopass. Got a Capacious Bucket and a Turfield Stadium. These are good cards. I like the Milkery though. Alchemy is one of the Pokemon I used. Well, Milkery is. I couldn't get the um, item to get Alchemy in my sword game. Okay. Okay. Uh, 
have the Sandy Ghast, Larian Yamask, Hello Sand, Training Cord, Electa Buzz, Gotta Get a Dose! Put that in the back, because I know someone who absolutely loves Gyarados and says it like that. Okay, another white code card. Alright. Toxel, that's cool. Electro, Tool Scrapper is a good card. Coming back from Dragons Exalted, one of my favorite sets. Got a Chandelure and a Horror Psychic Energy. I'll definitely put those at the back. And the last blister. The Giratina. Sorry if I'm taking these off camera, but y'all already know what's in them, and... There will not be any jump cuts, so that you know I am doing this legit. I know Darium says to not trust people who take their packs off camera. Let's do Ultra Prism first. Looks like we got the same Dawnwings Necrozma pack art. Let's see if we can get a Giratina Prism Star. Got the Glam Meow. More lol, Nebby. Lily! Didn't mean to ruin y'all's ears there. We got a Roy Luna Drapion, Drapion. Alright, Unified Minds. Can you give us some You can? You can, even if it's just a foil rare, you get you're giving us some last pack magic. Ooh. Definitely giving us some last pack magic. Alright. Got the Metatite, the Noibat, Sawaddle, Scorpy, Wimpod, Metal Energy, Arken, Archen, Yen Mega, Irene Bell, called Tinnitus Bell in Japanese. We got a Murkrow, and we got a Choo Choo. I have all the arts of this one except for the special full art. So, stay tuned for tomorrow's video. I'm going to be opening up a couple of uh, collection boxes, a couple of which are Walmart exclusive. But, um, thank you all for watching. Have a fantastic day or night. I will see you all in the next video. Try and get this Giratina out of here. Here's the second Giratina promo. Let's see. Here's a little bit of ding down there, and then I will see you on the next video. Bye-bye.